we can install python by going to the website that is www.python.org this is the official website for python python is open source software so we can download it for free so let's go to the website this is how the website looks and here we will click on downloads if you want to download for windows then click on downloads and click on windows after clicking on windows downloads then you will get the latest versions of python in the top and other versions will be available there if you want to install for 32 bit then you can download if you want to install 64 bits then also you can get you can see my file has been downloaded so open it after opening let's install close the window downloads and see installer has been started see we can install now or another option is customize installation so I will recommend you to click on install now as beginner so installation process has been started it will take few minutes so you can see the setup was successfully installed so setup was successful message came so close this pop-up window and we'll click in the search menu for python p-y-t-h-o-n see first one i-d-l-e python 3.6 that is the version number click on that this is python interactive mode here we can write line by line code and execute in the same window say for example this is interactive mode if you want to print then we have to use print command that is print 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 then inside brackets we'll write this is interactive mode this is interactive mode and now press enter see the output came in the same window if we write 3 plus 4 and hit enter the output will come 7 and this will also come in the same window line by line after pressing one line then you hit enter and if you want to do in script mode we have to do write the whole script then save as then run that is the difference between script mode and interactive mode say for example we'll write here print interactive mode same like earlier where we have done in interactive mode we'll do same in script mode also print inside bracket we'll write this is script mode and if you hit enter also it will not execute it will go in the next line again we will write print 3 plus 4 inside bracket 3 plus now we'll hit enter then it will not execute we have to save the file first save we'll save as interactive versus script and our extension will be file extension will be dot py 
or we can save as python file okay. save now we have to hit run or we can use f5 see the output came this is script mode and 3 plus 4 equal to 7 thanks for watching next video is coming soon